hello welcome to my youtube channel so you will learn how to ask someone how was your day in Igbo language okay okay so you know every language has expression that is indigenous to them okay and also there is no one way to say a thing in a language people have different ways of communicating the same idea so it is in Igbo language. Can you the English expression how was your day to check on someone? Okay. But in Igbo, how would you rather ask someone how was your day in Igbo? You are chatting with a close friend, you are chatting with someone at work. The thing you would say is literally some do say keduku boshigide. Kedu ka obochi gi de. Kedu ka obochigi de. Others we say ke ko bochigi de. Ke ko bochigi de. Hmm? Ke ko bochigi de. So the kedu will be wrapped up to become ke. So you hear ke ko bochigi de. Ke ko bochigi de. Ke ko bochigi de. Hmm? Remember, is this the ka that is being pronounced as ko? Because the U of the obochi, the U dot of the obochi goes back to swallow the R of the ka. That is why you will hear ke ko bochi gede. Okay? So the first one, kedu ka obochi gede, pronounced as kedu ko bochi gede. The second one is ke ka obochi gede, pronounced as ke ko bochi gede. Ke ko bochi gede. So you hear it as keko boshigedi. Alright. Other fast ways are an emekwa. If the person is at work, you can ask the person oru on agakwa. You can as well say, like I mentioned previously, an emekwa. How do we translate an emekwa in English? This is indigenous to Igbo. If you say an emekwa in English, it doesn't really make sense. It's become a word to word translation. We will not really make sense. In English, so if you ask the person an emekwa, it's like asking the person, hope work is going on, hope it is going on, like hope everything is in order, hope everything is fine. That's what an emekwa means, okay? So it's a it's an it's a question. Mm -hmm. So you can respond with eh, udodi, yes, all is well. Eh, udodi, yes, all is well. And as well. You you can ask someone how was your day in Igbo to mean a weekedi, a quarrel naga, a qua ikedi, a qua oro naga. Hope work is going well. Hmm. So it is not necessary for you to to mention the word obosh, which means date, for you to know that you are asking the person about this person's day. When you ask the person about his work, you are actually asking him about his day because his the work is one of the things that gets involved with the person, consumes the person's time during the day. So you are indirectly asking the person how his work is or how his day is going. So watch out for my second video on how to express yourself, you know, when you want to ask someone how your day is, different ways to express yourself in Igbo language. Enjoy Igbo. Igbo is a very sweet language. You have various ways to express oneself. Okay? I am your favorite Igbo language teacher. See you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Dalo.